Well, I think there are a number of, of fundamental changes from 2009 when, when the Copenhagen conference took place and now, uh, beginning by new leadership. Uh, some of the uh, largest nations have new leaders. There is more awareness of the impacts of issues like uh, pollution, for example, and, and we have clear examples. Uh, there's better preparation, more advanced science. If we look, for example, at the latest uh, IPCC report. Politicians are under increased pressure, more than in 2009. Reports and initiatives led by former presidents, like for example, Felipe Calderón, uh, former president of Mexico and the New Climate Economy Report, uh, the Bill Clinton Foundation, Al Gore, Jimmy Carter. Uh, to give you an example from the finance sector, um, corporate green bond market raises now money from capital markets for companies to make environmentally friendly investments. That in 2009 barely existed uh, and it's, it's now relatively popular. So um, I think there are different elements that leads us to think that, that this COP21 is going to be a success.